Alright, hey guys, how's it going? Today we're going to be talking about the rainy southeast going towards this weekend. We're going to be looking at, from the next few days, basically today through Saturday, is going to be our range that we're talking about in this video. But before I get started with the video, though, I'd ask that you do subscribe. If this is your first video, I do monthly forecasts, seasonal forecasts, and also forecasts like this for specific systems or events here. Like today, we're talking about the heavy rains, but I would be talking about severe weather, hurricanes, snowstorms, things like that as well. So go ahead and subscribe if you are interested in weather-related content like that. Now, we're going to be getting straight into this, and you can see this is for today. Uh, you can see there's a lot of storms popping up over the southeast, Arkansas, Texas, all the way to the east coast there, Florida, South Carolina, up through Virginia, and even Maryland. We can see lots of heavy rains, spotty heavy rains, all over the place. I'm only going to be showing one frame per day, so know that these storms are all over the place during these days. Uh, but we're going to move on to Thursday here, and you can see that the storms have moved, moved a little bit further east, or at least the low pressure system has where that heaviest rain is, and it's located over Louisiana and Mississippi as well there, as you can see at, by this point. But there's still heavy rain going on for Tennessee, Alabama, portions of Virginia and Kentucky and West Virginia as well. And we're going to move on to Friday and you can see the heavy rains are in Tennessee, North Carolina, South Carolina, Georgia, Alabama, Mississippi, Louisiana, Florida. All of these areas are getting very heavy rains. The reds, again, are where the thunderstorms are located. But uh, these are going to be all over the place during the day, moving east to west, or west to east, obviously. So we will see these. All, most areas get a consistent amount of rainfall. Some areas will miss this, and some areas will get it, because it's going to be quite isolated or scattered. Uh, but you, you, you should generally experience a few thunderstorms if you're within this you know forecasted region here. And then you can see here's our last frame Saturday. And you can see all up and down the east coast there we have those spots thunderstorms and basically rain showers going on everywhere except for Mississippi, Alabama, Arkansas, and Tennessee by this point because it's moved past that. Uh, but we're going to have a lot of rains over the entire southeastern United States. Like I said, lots of opportunities that rain here for the coming days. Here's your total rainfall and I wanted to talk about this. Basically, if you're in the green, any of the shades of green that is, you're anywhere from 0 0.01 uh, inches of rain that should be in, yeah inches of rain uh, all the way to half an inch of rain so that's if you're within the green region not a lot of areas in the southeastern United States are in the green region uh, but if you're within the blue you're anywhere from half an inch of rain to two inches of rain obviously the lighter shades of blue there are the heavier amounts but it's gonna be hard to pinpoint where the heaviest locations will be but I just wanted to you know kind of hammer in the point that m pretty much everywhere is in the blue by this point except for some areas in Florida and a little bit uh, west and north of the forecast region if you're within the pink uh, to purple color, you're anywhere from two to six inches. Those darker shades of purples are a lot closer to the six inches, so those are like four inches plus. The lighter shades of pink are kind of two inches to four inches, so that's where we're going to be at by that point. And then some of those reds and yellows is anywhere from six to nine inches plus, so anything above that. And obviously, that is tons of rain. So, according to the NAM model right now, which is the one I've been using this entire video, we're going to be seeing some isolated areas within the southeastern United States where those heaviest thunderstorms set up getting over six inches of rain which is really substantial I'll say at least six or at least five inches of rain within those heavier bands just to play it safe but some areas could get a lot more of that so flooding is definitely a possibility uh, as we have these thunderstorms over the entire area obviously uh, lots of rain on the way anyway I hope you guys enjoyed this video the new computer should be coming in tomorrow so there might not be a video tomorrow I'm gonna try to as I'm setting up the computer and kind of moving over all of my Photoshop stuff for making my maps anyway guys I hope you have a great day and I hope you enjoyed the video and I hope to see you in the next one